Hey everybody, I am back and let's see, we started building the Lights Out Corporation headquarters um, in its new dimensions. We have, uh, we're now building in odd numbers so that we can place things in the center. Um, didn't make too much of a difference, it, it feels a little bit bigger. Um, I have, I think, two stories built so far out of a lot, so plenty more to go. Um, let's see, let's climb on down. Not sure exactly what I'm going to do with these staircases. I kind of built these as uh, little platforms to jump down from and then to kind of help you from falling off just in case. Uh, that happens a lot, climbing up these spiral staircases. I'm not too sure about spiral staircases in general. They look cool, but they are just a pain to get up. But I, I'm not sure if I have any other real option for this, so I'll figure it out. Um, just planted a a temporary potato farm just to keep me sustained I'm not sure I haven't plotted out all the levels and what I'm gonna put on what level yet so that'll come later I have some s utility stuff here and a little bit of a little bit of music I still need to go out uh, go out and gather records go on a record hunt mellow high that's one of my favorites um, some sp infinite springs bed, and here's my storage. First, the first, very first level. So I still haven't put, I still haven't put lava around. I have to put lava down here. Um, Daniel Zappia suggested I put the, uh, the lights out headquarters light bulb down here somewhere and backlight it with, uh, with lava. That sounds like a cool idea. I'm not sure. So much more to go. So much planning. I still have to actually build a thing before I can even mess with any of that stuff. So I have been building. Um, let's see. There is the mine shaft is complete. That takes you from the bottom, spirals all the way up to the top. We'll 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 be uh, uh, riding on that a little bit later. There's a little waste disposal. And what else have I built? I that that leads to a mine shaft down there where I'm doing some strip mining. Nothing too exciting. Um, and over here, that's really dangerous. I have to block off bits of lava everywhere so I don't fall in. Over here, I have a skeleton spawner. With uh, this is the first one that I made with a light switch, and all of this is still really not clean. But it's functional. Uh, so this light switch turns on. It pretty much a activates and deactivates the spawner, which allows the skeletons to, to drop down. So let's see. Let's flick it on and head on up. So before, I was having to teleport to the to the other spawner that I built, which I'm not. I'm trying to keep it trying to keep it survival. So. If I can have everything within, you know, horse ride or minecart ride, that's ideal. That's what I'm shooting for. So there's a bunch of messy redstone wiring everywhere. But I put glowstone or redstone lamps everywhere so that in case I need to go back in there and work on the place, uh, it'll be safe. Yeah, here's a good little spot for just hanging out. So far, I've, I've been having the same problem as I did with the last spawner, which is when I'm down here at the at the collection point they don't seem to spawn I'll, I'll sit here I don't know if it's something up with my distance but they don't spawn usually the way it's supposed to work I think is you'll, you're supposed to sit here and they'll spawn and drop down and you, you kill them but that's not happening so I have to go up there let a bunch of them spawn and drop and then climb down and and do my killing but anyways it works and it's no big deal I'll figure that stuff out later there's much to do so let's take the the rail up to the top and see what I got up there. I've been having a little bit of fun with horses lately. So what I did here was I, I made uh, note blocks. I already have one of these. That sound off and let you know how close you are to the top or the bottom, whichever way you're, if you're traveling. So let's try that out. No block. Boom. Boom. And there's little cutouts. Boom. So you can see the uh, the headquarters. Boom. Boom. 
and it's qu it's quite a long ride. So let's see what else we have to talk about. We're fully moved into Covina and settled for the most part into the new apartment, and it's very nice. It's a lot, not a lot bigger, but noticeably bigger. Um, the couch has a little bit of room to breathe, and we got a nice view. And the drive to work is not so bad. So hopefully we'll be here for for another year when the lease is up. Look for a house. Almost there. Um, but other than that, I you know. I've been working pretty hard, so it's kind of tough to get out videos. Though most of the moving stuff is taken care of and done, so at least that's out of the way, and I can continue to focus on what's more important, which is building things in Minecraft. So as you can see, I built a stable to house uh, to house the horses that I found. Let's see. The Lights Out Corporation Equestrian Society is what I dubbed it. Um, I have uh, some decent horses. I went I went to town looking for horses and I pretty much tested out almost every single one in, in, in the first area that I found horses in. And mm, I found a decent one. This this little guy here is the fast one and this here would be the jumper, I believe. And here's my, my second horse that I found. Uh, tragedy's fallen. I have... I accidentally killed my first the very first horse that I had which was a bang up horse I, so far I haven't seen any other horse that was able to jump as high and I was I was away from the horse and something was attacking me and I accidentally shot it with a flaming arrow and destroyed it which is a damn shame because I was hoping to keep it for a sentimental value because it was the very first horse that I found so I guess number two horse will have to do so the stable has a couple, couple of windows so you can check out the horses. What else? Um, uh, what else I'm planning to make? Um, well, goodness. Let's see. The next step would be definitely to, to keep plugging away at the headquarters and build that up. Eventually destroy this and build to the top. I need to get that done so I can, I can start figuring out what I want to do for the top. Maybe move my beacons over and find a cool place to put those. If you guys have any suggestions on where I what I should do with the beacons, feel free to chime in in the comments. Um, what else? I need to, I, there's so much cleaning and sprucing up to do. I gotta destroy this. I have to destroy all that. Um, I have to move all my resources into the into the headquarters, which is just gonna be a terrible, terrible task. Um, but anyway, it's gotta be done, and once it's moved in there, then that's where it shall remain. Other than that, uh, what else did I have planned? Oh, yeah, okay. There's a desert out yonder, and I'm using it to gather all of my my sand and sandstone blocks to make the headquarters. What I plan on doing with that is, with the, uh, the wasteland look, I'm going to maybe fill it in with dirt or water, possibly, and I want to make a Super Mario level. Which it will be like a parkour-y kind of a Mario area, complete with all the little round clouds, and hopefully I can do some Goombas and some enemies and some automated stuff. But it'll be like a little parkour course that that'll, uh, that resembles a Mario level. I'm probably gonna go for the the OG Mario f Mario one, the very first. So that's that's the plan for that. That's gonna happen a little bit later. I'm I'm gonna try to juggle projects and so I don't get too tired of of the same thing, um, but that's it. That's what that's what I'll be doing. So I guess I'll catch you in the next videos when I when I start on all that stuff. Uh, thank you every guy uh, everyone for for watching and for subscribing, commenting, liking, and all that good stuff. It's uh it helps this channel and I just appreciate. It. It's cool to know that someone's actually watching out there. Um, hopefully you guys enjoy Minecraft as much as I do. So I will kill this creeper and bid you adieu.